back in another command video guys so I figured something out recently um so as you can see there's a bunch of holes and destruction around here because I figured out how to summon TNT at a snowball or an arrow so let me demonstrate if I were to throw the snowball it would just summon a bunch of TNT if I were to spam it um it's it's helpful for destroying stuff that are in the way. But what's really OP is if it's like an arrow. Reason being because the snowball would disappear, but the arrow would despawn eventually. So like here, I used an arrow and it dug all the way to bedrock using TNT. So that was pretty cool. Anyways, so this is how you do it. So basically, you have to use this execute command. So in a command block, which you would go slash give at p, or you can put in your name. This is my name for Minecraft. Then um, you put command block. So you get a command block, right? Then you go over here and put in, um, what do you call it? Put it down. Remember, you can only do this in creative. So, um, or would cheats on actually. Anyways, so then you would go inside the command block, which you would use right click, or if you have a different button set to use a block or use items, well, use that. Then you put execute, or you can put slash execute. Um, what do you call it? At, well, at E type equals, and then you can put it at anything. You can even put it at a skeleton. But, um, this is technically like a grenade, from what I would call it. So I am gonna put it at a snowball. The funniest part is, snow golems are gonna be really OP with this. Then, um, you run the command, and then summon oh, TNT. Honestly, it can be anything. You can summon bats and stuff, but it'll, it'll be more destructive if you put TNT. But just in it, as an example that it works, I'm going to put bats. So... Okay, let me turn off this command block or else it's going to kill the bats. So when I throw this, uh, I forgot to put always active. So when I throw this, it would summon a bunch of bats wherever it goes. So if I were to just spam that, it would summon a bunch of bats. See that? So <laughs> it would just keep summoning bats where it goes. Basically, um, to explain what this does... It would execute this command at this location. So, slash execute would run this command. But you need to put this first so it knows the location that it's going to run the command. So, location, and this is where it's going to, um, whatever you put here, will it will do. So, I can literally put this slash, uh set block what uh set block we'll just put these and then we'll put dirt oh i will put it like one above so it won't destroy it so in theory yeah i would just summon a bunch of dirt blocks so basically it will um it'll summon it at the location that you give it um, but if you wanted to summon it next to yourself or something, you'd have to give a coordinate. 
which would be like set block. So, um, well, I guess we can have some fun with this. There's a lot of commands that you can have. Hold up. There's a bunch of bats. I'm gonna, you know, just destroy them. Type equals bats. Oh, bat. oh my gosh. There was 1,575 entities. Anyways, so there's a lot of stuff that you can do to this. You can destroy, create destructive arrows. You can, um, you can make this for ender pearls and teleport around and stuff. But with this, you could do like, um, summon, uh, cats or arrows so like this would be helpful in mini games if you were to do uh the ender pearl or like the snowball like as in grenades and stuff so when you do that it would just summon a bunch of arrows and then you teleport to the last location honestly i don't know if that damages you but if i were just to go like oh oh you can't spam ender pearls i forgot See that? And then it can just create a bunch of arrows going everywhere. Um, so I mean, this could be really destructive and at the same time, um, really fun. The good part that, um, something that you could do <laughs> that would be really funny is the slash execute, right? Execute at, at E type equals arrows since they're all on the ground um run set oh wait no summon <laughs> tnt oh he's active oh, no! oh my gosh the lag oh <laughs> oh no the lag it's still going Oh my. Oh, it's lagging so badly. Hold up. I will be back after this. Alright guys, I'm back from all the destruction. So it literally just blew up this whole entire row right here. This is well... Oh my gosh, what did I do? Um, but yeah, there's a lot of fun things that you can do with this. So, um, I mean, this was one example. <laughs> um, you can literally make a detonation arrow. Um, hmm, what else? I mean, there's a lot of things that you can do with this. Other than what I literally just did. Um... Ooh, you can, hold up, let me get some bats, bat, right, and then, instead of summoning arrows, why don't we just TP at, no, at, um, just gonna, oh no, alright, hold up, I'm not gonna put bats, cause, there's gonna be something wrong with that. Hold up, let me put a phantom. You know, honestly, I don't want to do this because it might teleport me forever. So I'm not going to put always on. I'm just going to put a button. Okay, nothing happened because I forgot to summon in a phantom. Um, or actually... Maybe we could do it the other way around. At E. See, um, the good part about the execute command, you won't usually, well, you can't usually TP other entities to, um, a certain location. Well, um, to other, and you can't, 
let uh, how do I say this? So let's just say if you have two phantoms, right? You can't teleport them at each other or make them switch spots. But with the execute command, you're able to do that. So hold up. I'm gonna put at P. Always active. If I were to summon a phantom, hold up. I'm gonna put, okay, at Iconic Game Slinger. Okay. Um. Hmm. Oh well. Um. Hmm. I don't know how to fix that. I mean, we can summon a pig at them. That would be funny. <gasps> Wait. Anyways, though, there's a lot of things that you can do with this, and this was a um, bad example, the TP command, but, I mean, we can, like, summon pigs or so, or something. Anyways, guys, well, I hope you guys enjoyed. No, they're summoning at me. Stop. Please. It's literally pushing me around. <laughs> I'm not even moving at this point. Um, what is happening? Anyways, guys, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys learned something about commands. Oh, no. It's starting to lag. <laughs> you need to kill all the pigs. Type equals pig. All right, cool. That's even going to lag me even more. Anyways, guys, well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like and subscribe. Bye, everyone. Iconic Gameslinger out. Bye.